everybody, Rick was dumped, and I'm here today playing Overland, a game that I took a first look at a few weeks ago, but you guys really seem to like it. I really enjoyed playing it, so let's go ahead and do a full playthrough now. I'm going to go ahead and start a new game and begin here. For those of you guys who didn't catch my first look at this game, it's an isometric top-down survival game. It's a uh, roguelite, so it's procedurally generated, and it seems like every single time you start, you start with a different person and a different ally on the first stage that you can either choose to pick up or not choose to pick up. But I'm going to pick him up. Got room for one more? You can call me Sharon. So we've got Ali and Sharon here, which is uh, going to be fine. Okay, great. I think they're going to make a bang-up team. Me, Ali, the one keeping an eye on you. Oh, you're sassy. I like your sassafras. Okay, Ali, let's get uh, to the dumpsters now because now we need to do a little bit of scavenging. And you can see that in this game... You're trying to survive these bug monster things that keep popping out of the ground. Presumably, the United States has been taken over by these new bug overlords. Um, presumably, the entire world, for all I know. I don't know. Maybe it's just the United States. Uh, and the rest of the world just isn't sending help for whatever reason. Okay, Sharon found a stick. That's great. And uh, it's like Allie found a bottle. So those are just weapons, basically. Uh, those will be good for fighting. Those are fighting tools. But you don't want to fight too much if you don't have to, because you'll see. You'll see why. Once we actually have to start fighting, you'll see why you don't want to fight unless you want to. Or unless you want to. Unless you have to. You don't want to fight unless you want to. Uh, okay, Sharon is going to get in the car, and I'm going to use Sharon's movements to move the car. So I'm going to start the car, and then I'm just going to back it up a space. There we go. And I'm going to let Allie get inside. There we go. Now we're just going to get the hell out of here. Everything's been searched. We're ready to roll. Right? Yeah, we, we're leaving some bottles and rocks and stuff, but that's okay. Everything's been searched. We've got our new mate. We're ready to hit the road. Now we're on the map screen, so we need to decide where we want to go now. You can see that we're in the woodlands, the eastern United States. We're going to start making our way west. And we need to decide, do we want to go to Denver City or to Harrisburg? Both of them have fuel. Both of them are high risk. And both of them are only three gas away so let's go ahead and just i don't know let's go to harrisburg only because i used to live by harrisburg pennsylvania so let's go see how harrisburg's doing when i left it was doing terribly harrisburg is a real shithole so uh it looks like the same holds true for this place this place looks like garbage now we've got a big mama monster as i like to call him here and uh big mama monster is going to attack our car i just know it i just friggin know it uh big mama monster is a real jerk like that so here's what i'm gonna do I'm going to send Allie out of the car, send her right here, and here we're going to fight. I'm going to fight because we need to. I need to get rid of this big mama monster, and it takes two hits to kill. So I'm going to get Sharon out of here, have her finish off big mama monster with a stick. No, no, don't drop it, silly. Don't drop it. There we go. Kill. Okay, but there you can see two more monsters have been attracted now, so we have limited time to get the resources we need and get the hell out of here. So let's work quick. Okay, go get that fuel. Pick it up. There we go. And you can just go search this car there, Sharon. Okay. Ending turn. Okay, they have dug themselves out, and there's another big mama monster. So we've got more gasoline. Great. Okay, pick that up. And we're just going to go fill up the car now. And we're going to end turn. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to have... Fill up the car. There you go. No, you just siphoned it, didn't you? God damn it. There we go. Okay, the car's looking full, though. The car's looking pretty filled up. Um, Sharon, you're going to have to wait, and I'm going to actually have you get in the car, Allie. We can fill up at the next stop, okay? And now you turn on the car, and you're just going to wait. Next turn, we're going to put... Sharon into the car. There we go. We didn't search this car. Yes, but we're, we're counting our blessings. We're cutting our losses. We're, we're just going to leave. All right. There we go. You don't want to stick around and push your luck in this game. I've tried that. I pushed my luck. It never turns out well. Uh, now we need to decide. Do we want to go to Summerfield or do we want to go to on Alaska on Alaska? It's safe. It says, and there's someone stranded here. I think I say we do it. Let's do it. We have a hatchback, which means that we have one more empty seat for a survivor. 
with a hatchback, you can carry around up to three survivors. And, ooh, who is this guy? Okay. First thing I'm going to do is have Sharon go find out who this jabroni is. About time, heading west. As a matter of fact, I am. And let's have Allie get out and just use that gas can to fill up the car here. There we go. Better than nothing, indeed. Uh, end turn, because we're out of movement. Oh, come on, dude. I wish you didn't kill that monster. I hope you're as civilized as you look. You can call me William. Okay, now we've got William, Sharon, and Allie. Allie's going to go up here and search this car. You're going to invite William to the group. There we go. And you're going to move down here to this car. Come on, Willie. I'm gonna, can I call you Willie? I, I hope that's okay. Uh, Willie's going to search this car here. If he doesn't like that name, that's too damn bad. He found an empty bottle. What are you going to find up here, Allie? You found something flammable. Okay. Um, and that's about all that we've got. We've got a stick here. You may as well just grab it. No sense in leaving empty-handed, you know. And we should be able to get the hell out of here on the next turn. Okay, so that was relatively safe. Okay, it said it was going to be safe. It was safe. We've got a pretty good amount of fuel now. We've got a new member to our team, Willie, who's energetic, actually, and he knows shortcuts. So that's pretty great. So he actually has one extra movement, and he's going to help us use less gas as we move around. So that's a great addition to our team, actually. A really well-rounded team that we've got now. Okay, now we... Oh, there's another survivor here, but like I was saying, our hatchback only has three seats. So we don't even have room for another survivor. So I'm not going to go to North Berwick. They're going to have to figure it out on their own. We're going to go to Bristol here. And it's safe again. Useful items, and it's safe. This place is safe as well, but... I'm sorry. Whoever's over there in North Berwick, you're just going to have to fend for yourself today. Okay, it is relatively safe. It's nighttime. There's one monster... One monster should be pretty easy to deal with. We're going to keep it alive because we don't want to attract more monsters here. Um, just going to send everybody out to spread out and go search dumpsters. There we go. Great. And, okay, Willie, search this dumpster. Ooh, you found a pipe? I kind of like that better than the, the bottle. So let's go ahead and take that. Now... Oh, by the way, Sharon has CPR training, so she'll be able to revive people. That's a very good trait to have. Ooh, and a first aid kit, huh? Um, we have one in the car, but it's probably not a bad idea to have two. I'm going to have you hang on to that. And Allie, what do we have in this dumpster? A big knife. That's better than a bottle. Let's take that. Okay, so there's one more dumpster to search, and I can actually move William up here to go search that. All right, end that turn. Okay, the monster's going towards the car, so I'm going to move the car before it starts to attack it. I don't want it attacking the car. Now, when I move the car, I believe it's going to attract some monsters, so... Oh, no, it didn't. Sometimes it does. I'm not sure what determines whether or not the car movement will attract monsters, but it didn't seem to actually attract it that turn, which makes me happy. Uh, William, go search the dumpster. You can actually go back to the car now. And I could actually run over this monster if I wanted to. Let's do it. Sure, it's going to attract some other ones, but we're almost done here. So that's okay. And end that turn. Okay, Sharon. Get in the car. Willie, my boy. Let's see what's in that dumpster. And what do we got? Ooh, a toolbox. Toolbox is going to come in handy. When our car gets damaged, that'll repair it. And I'm going to have you hang on to that toolbox. There we go. And end our turn. All right, we're all ready to roll now. Let's get the hell out of Dodge. So far, it's been a pretty easy playthrough. I'm telling you guys, I played sometimes, and it just it gets so hard so quickly. Um, but everything's been pretty safe so far. And both of these things have useful items, and they're both safe. We're running very short on fuel, though. That's the problem. So I can go scavenge, or I can just go straight to the, the exit. And I think I'm actually going to do that because we're getting so low on fuel right now. We've only got eight fuel. If I go here and I spend six fuel, I'm not going to have enough to get to Mount Arlington and finish this thing. So if there's no fuel here, then we're screwed. I'm just going straight to Mount Arlington. We're going to get done with the woodlands here, move on to the next part of the map. Now, it does get harder 
once you move on to the last part of the map. There's fuel everywhere here, which is good. So what I'm going to need to do is try to distract these monsters, try to pull them around and have somebody go get fuel. So I'm going to send two people up here to sort of act as distractions. And then once we start pulling all the monsters over here, we'll start working our way around. Um, that's what we're going to do. Everybody just come over here, okay? There we go. Just get all of the monsters' attention. Okay, there we go. William, um, actually, you're going to need to... Everybody's got something on them, don't they? Okay. They can only carry one thing at a time. That's what I'm thinking about. You're going to need to pick up fuel, and you're going to need to pick up other things as well. So, let's see. Everybody move up to the corner. Keep drawing them around, okay? Go, Sharon. Ready? Why did you move backwards? That's such a strange thing to do, Big Mama Monster. Why would you do that? Um, you're confusing me. Okay. So, Sharon, you're going to actually start moving around this way, okay? And you're going to move down here, Allie, in hopes of attracting these guys come on come on monsters come get us okay good they're falling for it Aaron, grab that gas good job and now we're just going to move you guys ever so slightly okay there we go got one more movement oh great okay Aaron, fill it up We've got one more gas can to grab, and we need to get these dumpsters out of the way. We're not going to be able to get out of here until these dumpsters are moved. So we're going to need to move those. Sharon could actually kill this monster. I'm going to have her do that in a couple more moves. Um, you guys just wait right there. Great. Now Sharon can kill this monster, which is of course is going to attract it. Oh, wait, you didn't grab the stick, you dumb dumb. There we go. Now she'll kill the monster next turn. Okay. Um, keep hiding these guys over here if you would you guys are doing a great job you're doing exactly what you should be doing okay sharon kill the monster great okay two other monsters are now being spawned i hope it's not a big mon uh, mama monster that that uh much i i do hope okay there we go and william just move right up here okay there we go The monsters are a rumbling. Um, okay, Sharon, you're going to move down there. And now you guys can actually start to move down this way, okay? Come on, now you can actually start to get out of the way, okay? Um, Got to move these dumpsters. Okay, good, good, good. I think I think we can do this. They're just little monsters. We can deal with the little monsters. Okay. Um, we're going to need to start to kill the big monster. What I'm afraid is that it's going to destroy my car, and I cannot allow that to happen. Okay, Willie. Yep, just dodge and weave right through there. And Allie, you're going to move up here. Hopefully that's not going to trap you in. Okay, good. It didn't. Oh, that worked. That worked well. Allie can kill this monster if I wanted her to. We're going to need to pull this out of the way. There we go, Sharon. Okay, we made some noise. And we're going to need to get this one out of the way, too. Which means I'm going to need to mil uh, move William up here. Okay. I'm going to swap you out for a stick. There we go. Oh, you, oh shit. I should have moved you. I'm sorry. Um, need to kill. Whoop. Going to need to kill this monster. It's the only option I have. There we go. And you're going to need to pull this, bro. There we go. Great, 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 great. Um, now move right over here, Willy. And push this one for me. Push or pull? Push or pull? Push or pull? If I pull it, I'm going to be right on top of the gas. Let's do it. There we go. Okay. Um, and I need to get Allie to the car. Okay. Okay, now I just need to pull this out of the way. Okay, now the car has a clear path. I'm going to grab this gasoline and... Shit, which way am I going to go? Um, oh boy, okay. Um, go right here, okay? And, oh shit, you're going to die, Allie. I'm so sorry, you're going to die. There's not a lot of places for you to go. Uh, you're going to die. I'm sorry. Oh shoot, oh shoot, oh shoot, oh shoot, oh shoot. Oh, Allie! 
Oh, no. Okay, I do have CPR training. I can go to try to revive her. But I'm going to get hit myself. Um, William, you're going to get in the car. And you're going to start it. Put it right there. And... Oh, there's a monster right on top of Ali's body. Oh, no. Oh, no. William may be the only one who's going to make it out of here alive, actually. I think he is. Oh, no. I had to leave everybody else behind. Oh, no. Oh, no. What have I done? Oh. So we started the game with Sharon and Ali. We ended this episode with just William. Oh, brother. Okay. Luckily, there's a new survivor up here. We're just going to keep it on the down low that uh, we, we, we left two people to die. All right, that's just between us and the car. All right, guys, don't go blabbing about the terrible things that we did in this episode. Next episode, we're going to have to get gas, and we're going to have to make it across the Great Plains. And good God, look at how long the Great Plains are. It's so far. Oh, this is a gut-wrenching game, you guys, and I hope you guys are enjoying watching it. Uh, I'm enjoying playing it, but it is nerve-wracking. Okay, and if you guys are enjoying this, I hope you guys are. Be sure to give it a like, favorite, share, and subscribe, guys. Uh, it just really delights me when you do it. And come back next time in a couple days when I'll have another episode of Overland. Until then, I'll see you later.